NMR-based activity assays provide an effective method for identifying, evaluating, and validating inhibitors for a given enzyme. They're particularly well suited for fragment screening. NMR assays are amenable to the higher compound concentrations required for weaker inhibitors. In addition, the lack of reporter enzymes makes them less prone to false positives. We use the NMR assays in our lab to identify and characterize the inhibitors of two enzymes from Trichomonas vaginalis. Both enzymes represent new targets for novel antitrichomonal drugs. The NMR assays are generally applicable to any area of research that involves enzymes and they can even be used to study the enzymes inside cells. The most important aspects of the technique are to ensure that the correct reagent volumes are pipetted and the reaction components are thoroughly mixed. To prepare the substrate and test compounds, add 12 microliters of substrate to each of four 1.5 milliliter microfuge tubes and add six microliters of deuterated DMSO to the zero minute control and 30 minute control tubes. Add six microliters of the test compound to the first experimental tube and three microliters of the test compound and three microliters of deuterated DMSO to the second experimental tube. Next, add 300 microliters of deuterium oxide to a 15 milliliter tube containing 2.59 milliliters of reaction buffer followed by 25 microliters of enzyme solution. Gently invert the tube two times to mix reaction stock solution and add 10 microliters of 1.5 molar hydrochloric acid to a 1.5 milliliter tube containing 582 microliters of reaction stock solution.